<clears throat> What's up guys, Didi Cthulhu here. I got another surprise opening for you. As you can see, oh yeah, I got Broly from Dragon Ball Super. This is the newer one. And then I have an older Broly. This is a, uh, a stand-up fig pen. Um, it's like metal. Uh, and then it's on a stand on the back of it, but we'll open this last. So this is like what Broly looked like before, but this is a newer one. I pre-ordered this from GameStop about two or three months ago. Um, it just came out yesterday or today, one of the two, but I have been so excited. You can't go wrong with Broly. So let's get this bad boy open so I can show it off. In case you guys don't know, Broly is by far my most favorite Dragon Ball Z character ever. Oh, dude, this thing is so much bigger than I saw it. Holy shiitake, man. Oh, my goodness. Look at the sheer size of this dude. Holy smokes. All right. Well, let's start cutting around, getting this bad boy open. Alright, so for his back foot, uh, I stand. Look at the sheer size of this dude. And the details, absolutely insane. So he's got the gauntlets, he's got the battle scars, he's got the, uh, the bottom part of, like, um, Scout Armor, I believe that's what it's called. For those of you who have not seen the newest movie, um, if you're wondering what this little cape thing is, um, in the movie, he gets stuck on a planet with his father, and it's the ear of this monster that he becomes friends with. And um, his father well, didn't like that he was bonding with the creature, it's like massive too, like big, like demon alien bear thing. His father shot off the creature's ear because he wanted Broly to keep fighting the creature to get more experience in fighting. And that's what he has tied around because that was his best friend and he was never the same after that. So yeah, that's unfortunate. Um... Of course, legendary Super Saiyan form. You can't go wrong with that. Um, the attention to detail is awesome on this. You could tell they actually took their time with this figure. Now, if you're wondering about the price of this, this bad boy was, I if I'm not mistaken, it was $49.99, which is not bad. Look at the size statue you're getting. Um... I've gotten some statues that were significantly less in size for quite a bit more. So I feel like that's a hell of a bargain. Um, looks absolutely badass. So I'm happy for that. Now we're going to move on to this fig pen. Um, I don't think this is taped. I just, hmm. uh, let's see. We'll figure this out. Okay, no, this just popped right open. Thank goodness. All right, uh, here we go. All right, got this bad boy opened. Um, uh, let's see. I'm trying to figure out how to get the. Okay. Okay. Makes sense. So it has a stand. It, it's still a pin. So in technicality, you could uh, stick it on something if you want. Or if you don't, and you just want to have it 
as is. Put the stand back on it. Look at that. You got new Broly and old Broly. So, if any of you guys are bad, by chance a Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball fan, any of the series, leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. I look forward to doing more stuff like this when cool stuff comes out. This was just too cool not to share. And I know a hella bunch of you love this dude as much as I do. You can't go wrong with Broly. Um, comment down below, you know, hey, what your favorite part of Dragon Ball Z is, your favorite character. Um, we can have some conversations. I'm all for it. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that opening. Um, real quick, I didn't go over the price. The fig pin was $24.99, which is, um, it's not that bad for it being metal. Um, I think that's actually pretty good. I might put it on something like a small piece of plastic because the tips of the feet are metal. And you wouldn't want that scratching the surface or anything. Other than that, you got the badass legendary Super Sam Broly new one in statue form. Alright guys, I'll catch you next time. Have a good day. Peace.